Hello my Banda crew and welcome back to the channel. Today's video is going to be me discussing the patch of slots of the Crash Bandicoot franchise. Patch of slots are often found in uh, pachinko parlors. They're called patch of slots because they do not involve steel balls but they're loaded with tokens and coins and it triggers reels compared to those of traditional slot machines. So they're called patch of slots. So I'm going to be discussing Discussing all the information I was able to find on there's actually three versions of these these cabinets so we're gonna discuss those in today's video if this is your first time coming to the channel I release Crash Bandicoot content every weekend we discuss lore theories news we do interviews tier lists I have a Crash Bandicoot podcast now and we also discuss odds and ends like today's video where we're gonna be diving into random Japanese cabinet machines. So if that sounds like something you might be interested in, maybe consider subscribing. This is the first version of the machine. And the music you'll be hearing in the background is the official theme song from the Patch of Slot games. So both versions of the game come with the same mini games. However, the screens change in size. This first version, you can see the screen is really small and it's above the slots. And each machine has four main mini games, a couple side mini games, and boss battles. So your goal is to collect the crystals and to win the game. So I'm going to go over each minigame, and I'm going to show you the boss battles. So this is the first minigame that you could unlock. It's a claw machine game. And ironically, this is these Wumpa Fruits in the background is why this video exists. I saw online that there were yellow, green, red, and blue Wumpa Fruit. And I was like, I've never heard of any of that. Let me go and look. And I just kept deep diving. And I found out that this pachinko machine exists and that there's three different versions of it. And then I just kept going and going. And I found it really interesting. People didn't really go in-depth. I've seen a couple videos online of people showing off the machines. But there's no just like one video showing all the games and telling how they all work and stuff. So I figured I'd make this video. But yeah, so you have this claw machine game where Crash has, you could see on the, the right here... He has the standard claws that he'll put on his hands, and then he has the souped-up ones with little motors on them. And now I'm going to show you a clip of the actual gameplay in motion. So here's Crash. He's on the claw machine. He goes down, and he goes to grab the crystal, and he comes up with a blue Wumpa Fruit. So he didn't win, but... He, uh, got, he at least got some points. Now, I looked all over online for this minigame. I watched probably two hours worth of the pachinko cutscenes, and I could not for the life of me find this snowboard minigame. It looks like you have the standard snowboard, and then you have one with a rocket on the back of it. If anyone does know where to find a video of this, please put it in the comment section. I'll pin it because I wanted this video to cover the entirety of the machines. So it's just like a one-stop, check this video out, and you'll know everything about it. But like I said, I could not find any footage of this game. I assume you just go down the hill and avoid obstacles and then are rewarded with Wumpa. But now we're going to jump into the third minigame. So the third minigame, you ride Jeeps and you race Dr. Cortex. As you can see, there is the standard Jeep, and then there's ones with rockets on it. If I didn't mention this before, most of the assets from this game are taken from Crash Bandicoot Warped, or not Warped, Wrath of Cortex. So the visuals look like Wrath of Cortex, but then in the Japanese style. So I'm going to show you a little advertisement, and then I'll show you the actual gameplay.
And then we have the actual gameplay. You have Crash going into the minigame door, and it is Crash versus Cortex. I apologize for the low quality of all these videos, but like I said, I went all over online trying to find the best footage I could of each minigame, each video, or each boss battle, and I just wanted this to be a, a one video to sh showcase it all. And you can see the person lost the race here, and uh, they turn into the Crash Angel. Which brings us to the last full game. It's a shooting game. The gameplay has Crash shooting a cork gun, so I don't know why the power-ups look so drastically different. You have the bazooka, the Ringo cannon, as they call in Japan, or the Ringo bazooka, which is the Apple bazooka. And then you have, like, a souped-up version that Crash never had in any of the games. But, like I said, in the game, the gameplay, he's using the cork gun. So I'm going to show you a clip of that real quick. And as you can see in this video, you could see, or the image here, you have the red Wumpas, the green, the blue. And they could barely see some yellow Wumpas on the far left there. So he goes in the minigame door, and then he comes up, and he's got to shoot the crystal to get the crystal. And there's his little cork gun. And he shoots the crystal. Before we jump into the boss battles, I just wanted to show off these cool crates that are exclusive to these cabinets. There is the golden crate here. And then we have the rainbow crate. Both of which, I'm not sure what they do. I think they're just one of the multiple things that you can get in the slots. Boss battles real quick. As far as I'm aware, there's only crunch battles. And he doesn't have all of the elemental masks there is a low low fight which i'm showing you now and there is a wawa fight and there is a pyro fight so you have crunch in his giant form here launching electricity balls at crash as he's flying and the more damage you give him he will become a shade of red which i assume means it's his final hit unfortunately the footage here the player does not win but I'll show you him going red. So he hit him twice, and now there he is. He's red. So I assume the final hit would have taken him out. But the player gets hit by an electric ball and perishes. Next we have Pyro Crunch, which is just a chase scene. Again, Crash has to jump through hurdles and over boxes. You have to pick left, right. Or forward in order to dodge and then crash shoots a bazooka and takes him out and then this is the final boss battle I was able to find it is crash versus the Wawa crunch and this one he has electricity balls unlike in the game where he would just do waves so the player got defeated on the first attack this is just me showing off close-ups of the different colored Wumpa Fruit. Here you have the blue and the red ones. Here's Crash just looking at a blue one. Here's all the colors from the Claw game. You've got the red, yellow, blue, and green. Just in case you guys thought maybe the they just used those in the place of Wumpa Fruit. No, here's actual Wumpa Fruit in the background with Crash. So, standard Wumpa Fruit exists as well as the blue, yellow, green, and red ones. And then this is the second version. It came out in 2006. It was also produced by Sammy. This version is called the CR Crash Bandicoot. As far as I'm aware, it contains every mini minigame from the original cabinet, plus it adds new boss battles. And I actually have a video of... A tiny boss battle what's cool to note about this is I said previous these games took the assets from the wrath of cortex but this model of tiny looks so much better than the wrath of cortex tiny I'm gonna show you that clip right now <laughs> So Crash is just hanging out, and then Tiny Tiger shows up. 
He looks infinitely better than his Wrath of Cortex version. So my Bandit Crew, that is everything I was able to find on the Patch Slot Crash Bandicoot games. The only thing I was unable to show you was that snowboarding minigame. But I'm going to end this video on one last clip. It is a dancing minigame with Crash vs. Dr. Cortex. So again, I would like to thank... Danny Q, James Morgan, Crash Fan Japanese, It's Austin 01, Custom Pachinko, Pawn Shop Hero, and Sakio 2 for all of the footage and images I shared with you in this video. It's also worth noting that there was a third version released in 2007, but it was just an updated version of this second model. It visually looked the same. They just cleaned up the, the videos slightly. So there was a 2005 version, 2006 version, and a 2007 version. You made it this far in the video. I appreciate you guys. I hope you are entertained. I hope you are, you learned some stuff. And we'll see you in the next video. So you take care. Have a great night. Bam bam ba 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 bam de coo I see no tons de mo kana wa nahi Bam bam ba 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 bam de coo I saw we told you the bam bam ba Si kui otoko se bam bam ba Bam bam ba 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 bam de coo Bam bam ba 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 bam de coo